Hi everyone and welcome to this video. Today we're going to have a quick look at how you can transfer domains between Fastos account. So to start, I'm going to log into the account that currently has the domain registered within it. So go to fastos.co.uk, go to login and from here click control panel login. And on this screen enter your username and password and that should get you logged in. So from here go to your domain section and on this list of domains click on the one you want to transfer out so I'm going to click out fhvideos.co.uk and now on this screen go, click transfer options on the contacts and ownership tile and then transfer to another Fastos account so now we're going to need the account number from the other account and I'm just going to log into the other account so I can show you where the account number is. So this is the account I'm transferring the domain to and you can see the account number. If you're not if you've not got access to the account you're transferring to, you're going to need to ask the recipient to get this information for you, but this is the number you need and you drop the UK so you do not need to enter the UK part at the start. So copy that and we'll enter it into that box there. And there we go, so double check the account number that you're transferring into and click continue. And as we can see here, that transfer domain between account is currently awaiting validation, so that's ready to go. Now, you, if you accidentally transferred it to the wrong account number or you wanted to cancel it for any reason before the recipient accepts, you can click cancel there. But once the recipient has accepted that, you won't have that option. So like I say, cancel is just there if you need to. If you need to come back to this screen, it's, it's just a transfer tab. So now let's log into the other account and check on the status of that transfer. And as we can see at the moment, there's nothing here. Sometimes it takes just a couple of minutes for that transfer to come through. So I'm just going to pause the video there for a second and I'll come back when that has appeared in the list. Okay, so it took a few minutes, but that domain transfer has come in now. So we've got two options we can reset, reject, or accept. So I'm going to click accept. And then just as a quick warning by accepting the transfer, you will be responsible for configuration and the renewal settings as well. So we just click continue on that one. And that's been accepted. And now if we go to the domain section, manage domains, it's not showing there just yet. And again, it can take a few minutes. So I'll just pause the video there for a second and we'll come back to it in a minute. Okay, now you can see that domain has entered the domain name section, so it's fully manageable and the transfer has been completed. As you can also see, if we go to the transfer domain section, the status has gone from accepted to transfer complete. So that's the end of the video. Thanks very much for watching. Goodbye for now.